Hey, it's Sam from Dan Talk, Real Talk, Let's Talk. So I really want to talk about life and just how it goes today, how it feels, what it is, what we should do, what we shouldn't do. I talk a lot about being really annoyed with people with perception as reality. And I'm going to tell you one thing. Perception is reality only if the two equal out. If the perception is the same as the reality, then that's fine. But if the perception is different than the reality, we need to figure out why. Um, everyone has a life. Everyone has a personality. Hold on. Fluffy, everyone has a reason to be here. Everyone brings something to the table and communities support each other. They let each other be who they need to be. They don't try to conform everyone into a cookie cutter that you can put the cookies in the square box, put the lid on it, and hand it off. That's not what life is. That's not how it's supposed to be. I struggle with all these things in my head. I struggle with these bags under my eyes. I understand what the hell is going on with life. How do you really figure it out? And what is it all about? It's not about saying yes to people. Um, anyone who needs you to say yes to them all the time, they're the problem, not the, rea not the answer, not the reality. People aren't right all the time. No one is right all the time. It's impossible to be right all the time because systems change, things change, situations change. You're looking at something differently. As you age, you start to realize that what was really important when I was 20 is not so important when I'm 40. And by the time you're 50 or 60, it's a whole different ball game. Money is something that people stress about, try to figure out. I, I never did. I don't have any money. So the fact of the matter is, I believe you need to survive and you need to be able to survive and that's it when you die you certainly don't take it with you and um i know people who look at their stocks and their portfolio i'll never forget when that dude from uh, financial planning uh, had a meeting with me i think i've told you this he asked me where's your, what's your portfolio i said can you come with me to the cat room see look out the window see that that chevy impala there that 2000 chevy that and these two cats that's my portfolio he laughed he goes this is so refreshing. I said, look, you know what? I've since gotten rid of the Impala, but at the end of the day, life is about living today, understanding what's important. And when you put so much significance on certain things, you lose track of everything else. And that, my friends, is where things go wrong. I'm not suggesting that everyone needs to be like me because it is what it is. But I am suggesting that you need to be a little less focused on the material things in your life and much more focused on you, the spiritual, emotional, and uh, personal aspects of your life. Diane from Diane Talk, real talk, real talk. I hope you like what you see. Please like and subscribe, but most of all, please understand. See you later.